What's up guys, it's Saturday night here. Uh, we are doing another party now at the Ravel Hotel in Long Island City tonight. So uh, we're just going meeting a few friends beforehand and then we're going to be there at 10.30. So this is our second event now of the week. We're at Magic Hour on Thursdays and this is now Saturdays. So we hope to be here from um, every Saturday going forward. So I'm just going to give you a glimpse of what's going on all tonight. What's up guys, so we're just here in Nolita and uh, it's around 9 30 at night and as you can see it's absolutely tribal so after this we're just going to have a quick drink and then we're going out to the Ravel hotel for the saturday night party back home smoking legal i got more slaps than the beatles foreign shit running on diesel dog playing with my name that shit is lethal dog who you see what don corleone What's up guys, it is Sunday here and we are on our way up to um, Gaelic Park to watch the replay. It's like we're in the replay again, exactly like the same game last week. And uh, yes, yeah, so it should be a good all day. Hopefully we win. Fingers crossed. Good morning guys, it is Tuesday here and we are just on the west side. Uh, doing a little run down the whole footpath. Chase is back from uh, he's back from Montauk, so uh, he's putting me through some paces. So nice down here running by the river. It's like being back in Montauk, kind of, you know. So today we're just looking at more apartments, and then we're going to hopefully go back out to Montauk. Please God, we get our apartment sorted today. <laughs> Bring the clip back empty. Yeah, asked to see the ball, so they sent me, dog. I just broke off with a 10 piece, dog. There ain't nothing, I'm just being friendly, dog. It's just a little 10 piece for it, just to blow it in the mud. What's up, guys? It is a Wednesday morning here, and we're just after doing a small workout in the park, just an upper east side. Uh, just like a quick high intensity workout and stuff. And um, yeah, today is going to be a big day. We're signing off in our apartment, so hopefully that'll. I'll go to plan. As you know, um, many of you know, signing an apart off in an apartment in the city uh, requires a lot of paperwork, uh, like, you know, 12 or 13 documents per applicant. So it's going to take up the rest of our day. Getting ready for magic hour tomorrow on a Thursday. And then on Saturday, we have the big uh, party in Long Island City at Profundo. So uh, yeah, we're just going to do a bit of work for that as well. And have a good day. Of course. Wow. This is all fucking bikes when you need. As a man once said, it is what it is. You know, Jack used to be a soccer coach. And then I scouted him and I said, I can make a good nightclub promoter out of this fella. Uh, what a sicko. And I just made him into one of the what best nightclub promoters in the city. What so about, I was one of the best soccer about, coaches. I know there's a lot of people hit you up about being a nightclub promoter. What uh, advice would you honestly give to them? Like, it's true, a, a, a lot of people do actually reach out from even a fella from DC yesterday and there was a fella in Chicago and a fella up in Toronto and uh, the best thing is like just network 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 every place you go to try and get at least five numbers from it that's how I started off that's what a fella told me back in the day he goes every night he goes out he tries to get 10 or 15 numbers and like the, so that, like do that overnight you go five nights a week you know you just start building up your your uh, your network second thing is to be yourself be nice that's your brand that's how you build your whole reputation on being nice to people it doesn't matter what people look like it's a matter of treat people how you would like to be treated and that is pretty much what i've done for the last six and a half years and it's worked out you know, well for, all that's right all like i say like i just literally treat people how i would like to be treated if so, so, don't get me wrong sometimes i've treated people nice and they've been so rude and just haven't invited them back. They're not invited back. You know who you fucking are. <laughs> you know who you are. That's fair enough. Fair so uh, enough. that's what I say. They're the two main pieces of advice. Network, network, network. And just be very nice to people. Wow. You know? Words of wisdom there from Patrick Green. Be nice was number two. And number one was network. Unbelievable. Every night just cycling down here on the way to work and you just like going across these amazing buildings. You still gotta pinch yourself every time you cycle through. Got an apple over there. Got the plaza there. Central Park there. Wow. Burn. 
so we're here with the Eric Barnes Foot Rex. <laughs> we're here with the Eric Barnes Foot Reflexology. And usually you have to do eight minutes a day. Jack does them eight minutes a day. I'm gonna try five minutes. Starting. Starting now. So I'm uh, five seconds in. I'm in serious pain already. What <laughs> Good evening, guys. It is Thursday here. We're just gonna to go to our friend's bar for food. Uh, it's called Festival. It's on 61st and 2nd. And I'm just walking here on my own to meet Jack and the guys. And then after that, we're going to Magic Hour for our usual Thursday night hosting. So uh, yeah, should be good all evening. We're just after our first load, or first round of delivering out um, leaflets for our heaters, uh, for our heaters. And uh, the response is great. So yeah, onwards and upwards, tomorrow's another day. This guy's selling patio heaters while we're on our run. He's only four hours in the business. Right. What have you got? What have you got? A few souls. <laughs> 